Hello and welcome back. My name is Rebelka and this is the uh, 100 Baby Challenge and we are on to part 32. So um, we have Kylie here who is our first spellcaster baby. Um, so she's practicing and I thought I'd send her <laughs> um, to the magical realm. I just kind of cut it the loading screen there. That's why she suddenly appeared there. Um, so I wanted to send her here to look for some uh, look for some spell books, um, search for tomes, and to maybe get a little bit of training because um, she is our, our first spellcaster. <laughs> um, so, uh, but there's a, some sort of weird bug that she's not getting her points her, her, for um, raising her her spellcaster level. I don't know why. So she has no perks at all. Um, so let's see if we can find any books here, first of all. Um, and her father is, uh, or her other parent is, um, oh, I forgot his name already, Morgan Ember. So yeah, there he is walking by on the screen right now. So I thought it'd be interesting if she could get some lessons from him or them. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that if they'd had the pronouns when when this uh, pack was created, Morgan would be them. <laughs> um, so I'm just trying to find some books. We haven't found any yet, so we searched one one shelf. So we're gonna look at some more here. See if we can find anything. Oh, we did find one. Tome of the Nimble Mind. So we'll, we'll take a look at that later on. So now, oh, our needs are not very good either. So let's use the washroom here. Um, I just want to see who all is showing up here too. Because I don't know um, who all the spellcasters are. But it's basically only the spellcasters that come here. So, so we're done in the washroom. I'm just going to grab a little snack. Let's just get a quick meal. Some cheese crackers. There we go. So it's almost 5 a.m. on a Sunday. Okay, we can't search for tomes. Um, there's a cooldown. Um, you can meet a few people. And I'm not sure where uh, Morgan went. So Morgan actually has a house. Um, he's they've moved into one of the uh, houses. Um, I think it's in Brindleton Bay. That's because of uh, um, this the what do you call it um, neighborhood stories. So we're gonna ask for magical training. Figure if if anyone a, her parent would give her magical training. So. So he's teaching her how to do spells now. now she doesn't have a wand, so. <laughs> Even during magical training, she has to take a break and check her phone. <laughs> And I, I don't think the Sims check their phones nearly so much before the uh, high school years update. They've been checking their phones constantly since then. So she's getting pretty tired, though. I, I think I'm going to send her home soon. I did want to get uh, see if I could I could learn a spell or a, a potion from him. Yeah. 
Oh, they are now, now, I think it'll work. Recipe, uh, for... I didn't see what that was. I'll have to check later. Still can't search for tomes, so... I'm, uh, um... Yeah, and all the books they have in there are the magic ones. Or, like, like stories. So I might as well go home. So the glimmer stone will just bring me here. It won't actually send me home. So I just well, I just have to walk home. All right. So we're back home, and Kylie needs to sleep. So I'm gonna send her to bed. And how is oh? I was gonna say how is Quinn doing, but her her bladder is is very very low. I'm not sure why. Why she's not actually going her own. She's still watching TV. I don't know if, she, if it canceled because somebody else was in the washroom or what. But she's about to have a bladder failure. Yep. Um, it looks like Macy had the same problem. So have Macy is already in the bathroom. We'll have her take a shower. And Quinn's gone into labor. So... I knew that that would happen soon. So I'll ha send her over here to have a baby. And I've got 3,000 points now. So I would like to get uh, a reward. And I'm going to get the fertile one. Which just ups our chances of having multiples. So I don't know what it ups it to, though. I thought that. That's something I should maybe look at, at and see. Okay, I'm trying to send her in to have a baby, and she's getting angry because <laughs> she she needs a shower and a meal. But have the baby first, and then you can have a shower because somebody else is in there right now. Quinn is having a baby. Okay, so this baby will be N. It's a boy! Finally another boy! We've had so many girls. Uh, I think at this point it's like 3 to 1 um, girls and boys. So I did see an N name flash by there. So I believe that's pronounced Nasser. And so the last name would be Dawson Ember. Oh, no, sorry. That wasn't Ember. That was Inman. <laughs> Ember was Kylie. <laughs> All right. Oh, and a girl. So I guess we had twins. So Olivia. So a boy and a girl. Ah, now where's the other bassinet? They always put it in an awkward spot. I just heard somebody yelling. Why were they yelling? So, yeah, the bassinet's blocking the beds. Can't even get to the two of them. So I'll have to move that. So let's put this... Oops. Put the bas second bassinet in the room. There's space for three. We haven't had triplets, though, since right at the beginning. Second pregnancy was was triplet. Or was it the second one, or was it the third one? Anyways, we haven't had triplets since right at the beginning. So um, Macy's really embarrassed from having bladder failure earlier, so we'll just send her to the tent for now. <laughs> 
India's feeling energized, so I'll have her cook something. Just trying to find something to cook that doesn't use flour. Some of these don't tell me what they use, though. Um, but I guess we could use a bottle of milk and, some, and a chocolate berry. We have chocolate berries. All right. So Quinn, I'm going to send her to look after the babies. Because she can do the super efficient baby care, so. So when she's done her shower, she'll just be a minute or two. And I need to keep all the teens out of here. Okay, it's 12.30 in the afternoon. Why are you scared of the dark right now? <laughs> Send send uh, him in for a shower, Josiah. Oh, the phone disappeared just as I went to click on it. Okay, so Olivia is still not happy, even though we did the super efficient baby care. I'm try feeding her again. Except the the children stay out of there, please. So I'm going to send some people to slide here. I want both the children to slide and preferably everybody else too, except for Quinn. So that Quinn can actually look after the baby without any interference. Oh, and India reached cooking level three. I suppose I could lock the door to the nursery so that only Quinn can go in there. Because everyone else just causes interference. So. so there's the flea market is happening today. And the, uh, we need to get pregnant again. So I thought it would be a good idea to see who we could maybe take with us. So I'm going to take Nawai... Uh, now I can I I have no idea if I'm pronouncing her name right. <laughs> uh, there's not really many other people on here that I would want to take. So. So we just went with na na I na uh. Did I say her name right? So anyways, get to know her. Okay, it's it's hot out and she looks like she's dressed for winter. So I'll try taking a photo. So we'll see if this works. All right, so let's let's take our picture here. So she's wearing sunglasses. You can't even hardly see her face. <laughs> and yellow earrings that blend in with her hair. Okay, so when when the other person takes a picture, I can't even see my Excuse me, I can't even see my sim. It's like they've got their positions are all funny and weird. All right, so he's taking some pictures. <sighs> oh, our friendship's pretty good. Let's try a romance and see what happens. Oh. Romantic orientation. I'm flattered, but I'm not interested in that type of relationship with you. But I'd be happy if you'd like to be friends. Well, okay. 
Yeah, and like nothing shows up here. What about woohoo interests? Nope. Nope. So let's see if we can find somebody over here. Well, since we're over here. Maybe there'll be something interesting we can purchase with our 587 simoleons. <laughs> we have, like, no money. Kind of looking at the lamps, though. Maybe I could talk to the vendor? Oh, there's an emerald. We need an emerald. Well, she doesn't need an emerald. But if, if uh, anyone wants to make a potion, right now we have one that calls for an emerald. Oh, Quinn's really hungry. So there's a chair there with stuff sitting on it. I don't think you can sit on that chair. I think it's just decorative. We can't afford this cheap sofa. Well, maybe we can afford some food. So we'll order some food. How about some pho? Because not only will she learn how to make pho, but it's kind of spicy and get her uh, spicy uh, tolerance up. And try introducing ourselves to a bunch of people too. Maybe toss a coin. I was wondering if there's some, uh, sometimes you can get posters and, and stuff, but I don't, I don't really see any boxes for posters. All right, leveled up our charisma. Ooh, Quinn uh, is not used to spicy food. Well, I guess if we wanted to, we could probably sell stuff on the sales table there, or the the, the wall for paintings. And Carrie Flood is here. So um, I know from the previous interaction that she is a spellcaster, so I thought I'd take come over and... and see if, if uh, we can become friends and oh we can trade frogs I didn't know we could trade frogs maybe it's just while you were at the flea market so I'll try taking some photos with uh, Carrie There, so we can have some frogs, so... We'll see if we can find something interesting. I'm just trying this interaction out. I have no idea what she has and what I need. Well, it says she's learned how to make pho, so she must have finished eating. All right, I'm taking a picture with Carrie Flood. <laughs> oh, and then she's taking a picture. And I can't even, I can't even get it to focus in on, on the both of us. Like, it's just her. If we try a different pose. Yeah, see, 
It's just a picture of Carrie. Quinn is, like, not even in the picture. That's so weird. <laughs> I'm just trying to find a pose that I can actually get a picture of Quinn. But Quinn's just standing there looking at her. So... Might as well just get a picture of the weird face of Carrie Flood. Okay, done. That was so weird. Oh, Elliot's calling. Just calling to let you know we're moving. Call me whenever you want to hang out. So one of our wants here is to flirt with somebody, so why don't we try flirting? I'm flattered, but I'm not interested in that type of relationship with you. Seriously? Two in one day? <sighs> it's like, well, let's try for baby. That probably won't work, but we can always try. Nope. It's not working. Not interested in woohoo with women. Mm, yeah. Okay. Oh, Father Winter's over here. Take a photo with Ty. Who's Ty? I don't. I don't see him there anymore. He must have left already. But there's Father Winter. So let's go over and say hi to. Uh, I think that is, is that Clement Frost there. Probably. His head's moving. Oh, that's so creepy. I thought that was done. I thought that I'd fix that. <laughs> okay. Well, why don't we get to meet somebody else then? <laughs> so it's been a it's been a frustrating uh, trip today. Uh, the Lani, the Lani. How do you pronounce her name? Anyways, I think she's a mermaid. <laughs> Pretty sure that's the person from the uh, uh, um, what's it called again? Island Living commercial preview. Well, she'll flirt with us. Okay, that's good. Feeling very flirty. So I'm going to ask her on a date. And I can't remember where we are. <laughs> I guess it doesn't really matter, but... Oh, now she's dressed in her regular clothing instead of uh, dressed as a, a, a stall operator. <laughs> They're, like, not even lined up. It's so funny. Mentor child. No, we're not going to lock that one in. First kiss? Will we get kiss number eight? Oh, Nalani Mahiahi. No, Mahi Ai. Mahi Ai? Hmm. Anyways, Nalani. <laughs> We're doing pretty well on our date. We've only done four socializations, but we're all already. Almost completed silver. Hey, <laughs> 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 
So I'm still trying to get to know her because our our friendship is very high. Oh, asked to be girlfriend. All right, let's try for a baby in the hot tub. Oh, there we go. We got gold. Our date's barely started. Oh, we can't get what? We can't get in there. Okay, well let's let's try go getting in together. Let's try get in together. Is it because it's against a wall that that didn't work? I don't know. Okay, come on over. There we are. So we can at least get in the hot tub. And then. Sim's household is too big. What? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, I guess I've got seven kids. So that's eight people. All right. Well, I'll have to hold on to that idea. But now I know who my next uh, person is going to be. So I'm going to end this date early. Yeah, ending early. So, I guess we can't get pregnant right away, but soon, Sunday. So, if 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 uh, one of our teens can age up on Monday after school, then we have a chance to get pregnant again. So. So I think I'm probably get, going to, well, I've ended the date, so I'm just going to send Quinn home now. All right, so we're back home now. And, oh, first thing of all, we need to look after her needs. Oh, she really needs to use the toilet. <laughs> so look after her needs here. So we can't do much about aging anyone up until tomorrow. So it's still another day until the, the twins can age up. Uh, let's see. So India's still, like, I'm just checking to see how much they have to do before they can um, get a higher grade. It's, and I really don't know when it is that they can go up. Oh, fried fish is, uh, let's clean that up. It'd be kind of gross to have in your inventory. So we've got some fertilizer for the, um, like, the, the crops that you can grow from cottage living but you don't have any of those actually planted so just for now I'm gonna uh, put them in Quinn's inventory she might use them later I'm trying to put as much into the fridge as I can because it's entirely possible that uh, um, Josiah could age up tomorrow so we'll just put everything we can in the fridge or um, in Quinn's inventory either way and also we need to make sure we get our homework done, which it seems to be done. We don't have any projects though, so. Okay, we are hungry, or Josiah's hungry, so. But just a bit, let's let him do his own thing for now. Okay, so we have this magical tome. Oh, we already know it though, the Nimble Mind. So, so we actually have two of those potions in our inventory. So once we put that away, then we'll do our homework. Um, so that that tome will be helpful for the next spellcaster we have, who at this point is um, it's Macy is the next one who will be a spellcaster. 
So she'll be able to just read the books and to learn the potion instead of having to experiment to find that one her, on her own. And the books are actually preferable, I think, because then future Sims can learn as well, just by studying. Um, I'm really, really hoping that somebody can find the one for repairing items, objects. Because uh, then if we get anything that's burned out of the uh, out of the dumpster, we can just repair it. Um, and then actually use some of that stuff instead of just selling it. Because there's some things that I would have loved to have had in the house, but uh, they're burned and we couldn't use them. Okay, so I'm sending Macy. She's playful right now, so I'm going to try to get her to play on the jungle gym. And babies are awake, so we'll get Quinn to look after them if we can. Although India's there right now, interfering. India has the aspiration for Mansion Baron and wants to own 15 pieces of art. Better get working then. <laughs> we do not have 15 pieces of art. And Kylie has a Zen Guru one. I'm not even sure how to do some of those things. I'll have to look into that sometime, but I'm not really going to concentrate on, on her aspiration right now. I'm, I'm going to be more concentrating on her spellcaster ability. So we're going to give the potion of magical aura to Quinn. And Quinn can use that sometime to um, see who's spellcasters, who, who, who different people are, who, are, who has the magical aura. I think it and that's what it does. So you can see who is who is a spellcaster and who isn't. That'll be very useful for Quinn. Okay. I need to put more lights over here. I like to have lots that are well lit at night. Because um, at night you can hardly see anything. It's so dark. Unless it's a full moon. So, which it's not. <laughs> on like its last quarter. Okay, Kylie, I wanted her to do her homework and she did not do her homework. And she also needs to take a shower. And she's scared of the dark. Well. And India is wearing a top that is almost the exact same color as her skin. It just blends right in. I wondered at first if she was even wearing a top, but, but yeah, she is. It's just blue. So Kylie only has a weak bloodline, which means that she inherited that particular trait from her mother and from Quinn instead of from Morgan. Because with Morgan, she should have gotten, I thought, an ancient bloodline. So, were you sleeping in the dumpster again? <laughs> because Josiah is a, a slob, he often will have a naps in the dumpster. And he doesn't care. You should send him dumpster diving, he'd probably love it. So I'm just checking to see if there's any more plants here that need to be evolved. Some could be harvested. And then our bees too, they need to be looked after. So Kylie's fishing right now. I, uh, for some reason she has a potion stuck to her hand. That's a little odd. I think one of them did not make it to Quinn. It's stuck on her hand. Because I don't see the, the, the I don't see the potion in Quinn's inventory. Oh, Quinn needs to clean out her inventory. She's got so much spoiled food in there. Ooh, Josiah's reached level three of the gardening skill. That's good. His homework is completed. He's got the skills that he needs. Um, 
And his queue is full, otherwise we would send him to bed. So Macy's hungry. Get her something to eat. And she's done her homework, so that's good. The twins are still awake. The, 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 oh, sorry, we have two sets of twins right now. The uh, baby twins are still awake, but they seem happy at the moment, so leave them alone. So I'm trying to get Macy to play in the tent, but she's, oh, she's going now, but she's scared, so. And Laurel is happy. Or fine. And put the food back in the fridge. It's kind of hard to see what I was doing there. Have her go, oh, no, that's Josiah. Josiah can go to sleep now. His queue is not so insane. <laughs> It was pretty full there for a while. And so Quinn will have her get the mail. Kylie's done her homework. So I'm really hoping that we can age up at least one of the teenagers um, Monday. So today, I guess, because it's 5 o'clock in the morning. So Josiah really does need to sleep. Come on, hurry up. Just doing the bees, and then you can sleep. Quinn got the mail. We've probably got a bunch of diplomas to put up now. So I'm going to have Quinn eat something, and then maybe do a yard sale. So 5.30 in the morning. I'm not sure how many people will, will show up. We'll see. She likes cottagecore music. Yes. If they say they like cottagecore, I will definitely say yes, because that is Quinn's favorite. Okay. Laurel, go to sleep. Macy, try to go to sleep. Quinn. I thought Quinn was supposed to eat something. But... St well, we're having, we're, we're having a yard sale. Come and buy our stuff. Come and buy our junk. <laughs> oh, Kylie gained a um, parenting skill. School starts in an hour. Okay. Come and buy our stuff. We've got lots of junk. Come and buy it. Come and look at the table at the very least. There's nobody there. Oh, there's someone. Oh, it's Simeon. Naomi Mead. Okay. Okay, India's off to school. And she's getting credit for her project. So I want her to study hard, see if we can actually um, uh, get her grades up here. And it looks like two people are still sleeping. Quinn is really hungry, so... Oh, but I started another yard sale anyways. We'll see how this goes. We have hardly any money. We only have 445 simoleons. Okay, we'll go look after the babies, and then we'll come back and tend the table again. I like with multiples. I like to do it kind of like a um, assembly line. Just do everything all at once. But for some reason, these guys are offset. They are not both upset at the same time at all. Okay, you can go to school, and you can go to school. I guess it's only nine sixteen, so they're not really considered late yet. But they do need to go. I'll have them study hard. So we're trying again with this yard sale. See what happens. Somebody's calling. Oh, scholarships. Boring. 
Nayeli, hey, I heard you became good friends with no Noai. Noali? I can't, re I can't remember how it was pronounced. Okay. Wait and see. Our phone is still ringing. We've had a text message, a phone call from the school. And the mail's been delivered. Okay, our yard sale is now done. Oh, and it's it's a birthday. Okay. So we need to grab something to eat. So we'll do leftovers. And then our super efficient baby care. Times two. Okay, food's almost done, and we will look after the baby. Okay, why did you just walk right in? Do you want to become best friends? No, thank you. Oh, that put our friendship down quite a bit. Olivia aged up. Oh, clingy. Okay. And then... Nasser aged up. Oh, independent. I like that. Independent w toddlers are the best. Because they can teach themselves how to uh, go potty. Okay, was she just sleeping in the bed? Excuse me, you were an uninvited guest. Alright, and I want to change the... Um, because I've got CC uh, head headpiece here for a Star Wars character, so I want to get rid of that. And just change them up. Put some nice clothing on them. There we go. Make it all pretty. And do Nasser here, get him to look nice. And they are both spellcasters. That's great. All right, well, I'm going to end this here. So uh, thank you for watching. Don't forget to click like and click the um, subscribe and the little bell for notification of, of more videos. And thank you for watching. Bye.